Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Nana, and today we're back with the second episode of Let's Play The Sims 4 Get Famous. <laughs> Prized to see poor old Salem on our doorstep, but trust me, he's not being a stalker or anything. Um, despite that it might look like that. Good camo pants. I love me some camo. My boyfriend loves me some camo. We probably that, that that's not exactly how I wanted to say that, but he does. He loves them and I I think it looks so hot on dudes. It wasn't actually our idea to invite over Salem. Uh, we talked to Savannah last night right before bed and she said that she wanted to do some exploring. She wanted to explore her options and uh, snoop around, see what's hot, see who's not. Just for the funds of oh oh mistake mistake x ex, exit x i just had to see what it looked like and it was as much terrifying as i expected it to be so then i kind of convinced us to invite over salem as we didn't really want to come with her during her snooping when she does her snooping aka research she um goes a little nuts she'll ask around she'll snoop around she'll do anything to find out exactly what she wants to know we really don't want to be there we we really don't want to be there when she goes that crazy i rather not associate myself with such a person i like how we um um met up with salem in her pajamas and all that but i think it's time to get dressed since we are meeting her later today and it's already 3 p.m and it's kind of kind of late i kind of want him to be out before four and of course that's not happening because we haven't seen each other for so long and i i i really have missed him and he oh he's such a sweetheart he drove over here he drove the entire night just so he could see us and of course he would say yes i mean why would he you know why would he say no like that's totally not salem but he also has work and he put his work aside for once and drove all the way over here just to be with us and it's i i feel so loved by this man i am honestly so happy with this marriage and how everything is going i couldn't be happier i i felt like it was the right move as well i feel like now you know he's kind of seen where i'm staying and i think he can see with his own eyes that he has nothing to worry about and he's you know he's saying as well like i'm sorry for all the texts and stuff i just was really nervous for i don't know being without you and being on my own and you know you're you're my girl and i i don't i don't want you to see and you get any trouble you know it's like i i know about your past and i just want to make sure you're all right there's like so many things going through my mind but salem you don't have to worry one bit about us honestly i think you should be worried more about yourself because i think we are grown we we can handle ourselves but it's super sweet that he was concerned and hopefully now that is where we're living and all that he can chill out a little bit see I need a new outfit. I don't want to be seen like this. I need, I need something new. It's a little dramatic, as I might say so, which you could probably never tell. It's like, yeah, whatever, you know, if you want to fuss about that and, you know, put on your nicest dress, you, you, you do you, boo, but I'm not about that life. If you haven't seen any other Let's Play, which I highly doubt, I'm sure you've seen like 20 already. It's the actual the new map of Tim Delve Soul Valley, whatever. I never pay attention to names so we have the pinnacles for the most famous sims we have the marriage park for just the average sim i guess and then starlight boulevard is where everything happens we have a gym we have a lounge a museum and then we have another lounge i think one lounge is for celebrities and then one is more common for you know upcoming stars and a little park and um, the place that Zvena wants to show us is the celebrity celebrity lounge. And oh my god, the amount of celebrities that Zvena saw drove her absolutely nuts. She would almost come home screaming if she could. Just <sighs> seeing a celebrity in person, like you don't even understand. Back where we are from, back in you know Oasis Springs, even in San Maishuno. You don't see celebrities on the street like that. You don't ever see or hear from a celebrity. You see them on TV. You see them on advertisements, on the billboards, but you never ever see them on 
you know, in the streets, just in person. And for whatever reason, this girl is freaking out by our side. Even what is this? Why are we so shocked about Savannah? <laughs> I don't know why, but we're all kind of looking in awe at Savannah. She looks really good. That's probably why. She's actually coming over here. She's going to have a look at the stuff. I'm calling Cassie over to come and look at this. This one has clearly been smothered with some paint, but that one seems to be in working condition. And boy, oh boy, look at all of these celebrities. I'm just gonna feel that one. Oh my god, wait, wait. This is the one that's. Oh my god, oh my god. Do you see this? She is. Oh, oh, oh okay, you guys, you, you need a little bit of backstory on this. You deserve a little bit of backstory. Oh my god. So let me just tell you whose stone this is. So this is the stone of Isabel, and Isabel is the sister of Rosia Bell. There are two sisters and um they are oh there they are there's rosita and isabel they are pretty much her enemies and they used to be super famous um in send my shuno until there was a scandal and all of a sudden honestly i'm just gonna ignore the celebrity behind us just for a second just for the sake of explaining guys this but um the reason why we're looking in such disgust is because um, of what happened. They used to be our friends, they used to be Savannah's friends, but they kind of ditched her along the way. Then a scandal happened, and uh, as soon as you know Savannah got more famous than her, hell broke loose. And because of the scandal, they kind of, you know, just, how do I put it, they... They vanished from the ends of the earth and we thought they would never, we would never hear from them again. But to see that they have their own stone is absolutely infuriating. Just, oh my god. This is just, this is her worst nightmare. Oh my god. Not only has she now made it her personal plan to destroy Isabel's career. You know, she always, she already wanted to be famous, she already wanted to be in the spotlights, all of that, but now she wants it even more. She wants to destroy the sisters. She wants to get rid of them <laughs> once and for all, which is kind of dramatic, but we really, 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 really dislike them. Honestly, we really, really, really dislike them. Oh, look at Cassie being a good Samaritan. She's like, I'm going to clean this up because I don't hate this girl, but she definitely deserves one. So I wouldn't be surprised if Savannah actually ends up trashing this one. But right now, there's like celebrities and all that happening behind us. So perhaps not. We'll respond to that in a second. But here they are. Here is Isabel, and uh, yep, we're, yep, we're pretty much enemies. Now, let me pause it. If you want some real juice... This is gonna get a little bit complicated, so please pay attention. Okay. Had a relationship with Miko, our best friend. He got her pregnant, they had triplets, and he left her and then started dating me, Cassie, and Savannah. He left me, he left Savannah, and then he moved on to Rosita Bell, and he actually got her pregnant as well. Then when he got her pregnant they had a kid together they got married moved on to isabel her younger sister got her pregnant and then he got divorced from the first sister and married to the second sister and this is a big old scandal going on it was already a scandal that um they both had you know babies from the same guy and all of that Speaking of the darn devil, who in, oh my god, I am honestly, just honestly. Savannah is feeling extremely awkward right now. Cassie's walking away. She's not even up to date on whatever is going on or is about to happen. But oh my darn gosh. Oh, is this our fan or something? No, it's not our fan. It's just a general fan. I was like, how do we have any fans? Oh my god. Look at that. You know what? I am actually going to come over there and call her over. I am going to pretend like nothing is going on. Cassie's coming back. She's like, oh, oh no, something's going down. Something is going, flipping down. You, how, how, how did you deserve a flipping? 
How did you deserve your your own star? How? You were literally the worst human on the entire planet. I despise you so incredibly bad. I like how Kes just standing by, just like, wow, wow, really? Like, she's kind of confused about what's happening right now, but honestly, like, you stink. You are literally the worst. I don't like you whatsoever. Your mother is a llama. Ooh, damn, and even though we are digging her outfit oh my god are we gonna fight her are we gonna fight her oh i'm going to fight her i am honestly maybe a little overwhelmed by jealousy that she has a star and that despite all the scandals and kind of ruining everything that's good and well she has you know become quite a superstar and i don't know i just i just really really don't like her oh my god cassie where's cassie cassie is just over here just silently supporting her friend on the guidelines just on the sidelines being like yo you better give her, give her a left give her right she's probably like coaching her you know left right left right i kind of wonder where her sister is her sister used to be the one that was primarily you know she was the one that was all the talking she was the one that um was more famous than anything else but it seems like isabel has a star and i don't think her sister rosita has one so that must mean she actually surpassed her sister which might cause some drama especially since she stole her sister's husband and had a baby with him and then married him there must be some actual big drama going on and i don't understand how this relationship between them are is still a thing like how could they still be close sisters and uh, maybe they're not maybe there's something more deep deeper it's like something deeper going on i honestly don't understand cassie is not the type that will really do anything crazy but she really 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 ruined her life and as much as we would love to kind of trash her you know her um i would say it, her star her tile her star i really i i can't right now like i am too nice too good of a person like i could never do that you know what if this is on national tv i honestly honestly will not care one bit if this is what the paparazzi wants some drama if this is what's gonna get me my fame so be it i will expose her I will expose these damn bitches. I will expose her. I really want to do something bad, but I can't right now. Because, um, it's not very polite. Forget about her. Forget about these ugly sisters. Forget about everything that just happened. Like, she's like, how, girl, how could I just forget about what happened? You just punched her in the face. And everyone saw that the entire world is going to know that you just punched her in the face and i honestly don't care i really don't care i really don't care right now cassie you know what i really don't care and i'm gonna do something that i might regret maybe not but it feels right at the moment i need you to stand by i need you to look out for people okay i need you to be here be my sidekick have my back and then once i come to you we run we make a break for it okay we are going to make a break for it okay and the fact that she's not even like looking at all these celebrities or anyone else she only has eyes for cassie and the si just wait until i'm done wait just wait for it i can tell that she's feeling a little uncomfortable so i'm trying to make her feel better and it looks like everyone is leaving she is walking back to the store i'm not even doing anything she's doing this out of her own well oh my god she's coming back to the star even cassie is kind of like lost in thoughts just staring at it it's cass you have my back right you have to tell me okay you have to tell me if someone's coming you have to make sure that nobody is here okay you have to you understand me you have to make sure that you promise me you'll tell me all right because what i'm about to do is going to be bad <laughs> I am going to deface the star of Isabel and I honestly don't care. I'm going to have my girl Cassie on waiting. 
Cassie has my back. Everyone is kind of focused on, you know, the paparazzi and everything. And it looks like we're just, you know, just looks like we're we're looking at it. We're not doing anything. We're just kind of staring at it, right? Nothing, nothing big is happening. But oh boy, we are destroying her one and only star. And oh boy, does it feel good. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at her face. She's like, yeah. <laughs> You deserved it. This is over here looking pretty worried and she's oh my god She's trying to clean it Cassie. I swear to god. I'm going to fight you like this is going to cause a little bit of an argument I'm going to yell at her and like what are you doing? You're gonna get us caught. Don't don't do anything. Please just just leave it Let's get out of here. Like you're gonna make it worse. Don't don't be stupid right now Cassie What we're doing right now is not exactly legal. Oh my god. Okay, let's just get out of here before anything bad happens it's almost 4 a.m. and I'm still away, just making a wake? A wait? Did I just say wait? I'm still awake and I'm making myself a pot of coffee. Honestly, this was not what I expected. And the fact that our enemy is here, famous, more famous than me, mind you. I I don't really know how to process this, and I'm just so much more driven now to become the best flipping actress i don't exactly know what she's doing you know what i'm going to actually go online you know what i'm going to check something i am going to go through her twitter go through her instagram do something like that and see what she's up to because what exactly does she do that makes her so incredibly famous right after looking on her phone for a little bit we realize that she's actually a famous actress and this ticks us off even more because um yeah that's my dream why are you living my dream why does someone so bad so nasty so backstabbing as you deserve to be famous deserves to be be in the spotlights like how oh apparently oh sorry cassie's eat off she is so peed off right now i don't even cassie is able to sleep right now she can just hear savannah mumbling to herself in the bedroom she's gonna ask her like do you need anything do you want me to be with you stay with you like what do you need me to do but savannah she's like Cass, just go to sleep like i'll be fine i just need to just be by myself a little bit and please don't stay up too long you're just, just let's not pull an all-nighter just go to sleep sav please go to sleep and yeah yeah I'm, I'm coming Cass. don't don't worry about it it's a conversation like that just a very simple you know adult conversation like there's no need to stay up if someone doesn't want to you know what i mean like we can handle ourselves it's just we didn't expect this we're feeling really confident and honestly we should be going to sleep but right now all i want is to record a video um and i i actually what i really want to do is start my career now i did make some coffee and i'll probably go and get that but what i also want to do is get myself a job now I was going to wait a little bit, you know, see what's hot, what's not, maybe try and make good in any other way, kind of work my way up to fame, careers, being an actress, jobs, but you know what? If my enemy is an actress, then I don't care. I mean, that's serious. She is going down. If they think they found the best actress ever, damn sure not. I am better than her. Honestly, I'm so fired up when I think about this. Like, when I imagine this girl to be real, all the, all the the shit that she pulled on us oh i almost feel personally attacked like i honestly almost feel it in my soul like i want to take her out so bad so i really want to be better than her and i want to take her out and i'm not sure how to do that yet but oh boy we have a lot of scandals about these sisters that were mm, wait until we distribute these mm -mm. the world does not know what's coming for them anyway we can select an agency um okay so our agents look forward to booking your unproductive time with work, okay? Or we can have face... We'll find you work no matter how small the role. So this one will um, maximize your time spent working. This one benefits more auditions for commercial. I think we're going to get this one. The Everyday, the Everyday Excess Talent Agency, which is really, really nice. Okay, so now that I did that and it's kind of turning late, it's, you know, it's getting light and I haven't slept all flipping day. I think it's time for me to pack it all up and get into bed, get myself, you know, get myself into bed, you know what, get myself into bed, get some sleep, you know what I'm saying, and all that, and bye, and, 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 and since the girls are getting some sleep, I think I'm gonna do the same and um, call it quits for today.
first parts, right? Well, it's actually a second part, but I feel like the first two parts are getting the storyline going. But once we're there, once the storyline is set, fresh episode, and I'll see you guys in the next part. Bye.